Welcome to Football Feud Free Point Out. Today's video is brought to you by DraftKings Sportsbook. I have Panic, Jake, and Jack competing once again in the most competitive game of Football Feud yet. If they get the number one answer right to each category, it's worth five points. If they get the, if they get the number five answer right, it's worth one point, and free incorrect answers means you're out. So don't get them wrong. Now let's go to the video. Are you fellas ready? Yes. Ready. Yes. All right. And I have a very special theme for you guys today. It'll be 2023 NFL season edition. Mm. Highest yards per reception mm. in 2023. Minimum 30 catches. And a hint, they're all wide receivers. This guy is just so good. I'm worried he's got so many catches it might hold him back, but I'd be remiss if I didn't guess Tyreek Hill. Ooh, good guess. Unfortunately, not on our board. Mm. I will say, this is one of the harder categories. I wanted right. to open up with a hard one. Thanks for the one pick. You're welcome. Tough. I would like A.J. Brown. A.J. Brown is not on our list. Mm. C.D. Lamb. No. Also not on our list. Hey, good first round. Good yeah. first round. All now, right. as you guys have all gone through it, I will say, four of these guys you can get. Awesome. I'm going deep. I'm going for the hard one. Mm -hmm. uh, this guy, I think, is the newest deep threat only kind of in the NFL. Can we say it on three? One, one, you're up next. It's oh, so I guess it would be your guess. If you Is it your guess if I don't guess it? Yes. So this is a dual guess. <laughs> I don't know how that works, but I'll allow it. Three, one, two, two three. Rico Rashid Shahid. Okay, those are both wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I'm up. <laughs> I mean, tech, somehow we ended up back to Jack. I will <laughs> offer another hint after Jack's guess okay. for your last round. I was going to guess Nico Collins. Nico Collins yeah. is a very good guess. Rashid Shahid's not a good guess? Highest? Um, I just couldn't input that yeah. one because you talked at the same time. I'm not that smart. So so it's wrong. Still. It is wrong, yes. Okay. I, thought it was, I actually thought it was right? a good guess. I'm going to go with Brandon Ayuk. That is a very good guess because he is our number two wow. answer. Wow. 17.9 yards per reception. Wow. Common ball knower. Yep. Good for you. More like Brandon Ayak who's just so many yards after the damn chat. Nice. I could offer you guys a hint, but I don't know if you want I it. I mean, now we're rolling. I will offer you a hint that if you would like. Gas. I want the hint. Okay, two of these guys were wide receivers on playoff teams that have been eliminated. Mm. Oh. Uh, George Pickens? Is our number one answer yeah. with 18.1 yards oh per reception. God. Nice wow. work, wow. Jake. Wow, panic. <laughs> Football guy. All right, well, now we, there's another guy that. There is just the number kinda, three uh, answer yeah. is a wide receiver on a team that was eliminated in the postseason. All right, so let's use context yeah. clues here. Um, the Miami Dolphins know because we already have Tyreek Hill. I'm not going to say Jalen uh, Waddle. Could be him. Um, almost forgot Have his first seen name. His there. Celebration. I like his celebration. This guy's inevitable. He's really good. Thanos. I'm going to say Mike Evans. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't me. Show me Amari Cooper. Amari oh. Cooper is our number three oh answer. Oh my god! See, this is kind of tricky because you don't want a lot of receptions because that knocks down the. Mm -hmm. You know what? I how about Green Bay Packers Romeo Dobbs. Incorrect. Good guess. Though. That's a good guess. Though. That's a very good guess. I'm gonna go with Tank Dell. That is wow. incorrect. I love the Texans. <laughs> Show me the other Bucks wide receiver. Chris Godwin. Yes. That is incorrect. Not a bad guess though. The fact he helped you out meant yeah. it was wrong. Yeah. Okay. Our final two guesses. Our number five answer is DK Metcalf okay. Okay. at 16.9, and our number four answer is Noah Brown, a Texan. Wow. Oh my God! So we were all in the in the in the right territory. Oh, no. We all got points, and you didn't. <laughs> NFL passing yards leaders for 2023. So the top five quarterbacks who have the most passing yards. You should this clean this past season. I They're think this is a good category for you, Panic. I would like Dak Prescott. Yeah. Dak Prescott is on our board. Unfortunately, he's not our number one or our number two. He's our number three oh, answer. I'll take a and number three. And he had 4,516 yards. I'll take a number three. Dang. Jack, you're up. I will go with Brock Purdy. Brock Purdy is on our list. He just snuck in at the number five spot with oh, 4,280 yards. And Jake's going to love this. I do have a bonus point available at uh. some point. I will give it to whoever gets the number two answer. I will offer the bonus question to. Oh, um, I think I have an answer, but oh. not Josh Dobbs. 
No. Tommy DeVito? No. Good guess, though. <laughs> Tua Tagovailoa. Tua is our number one answer at 4,624 yards. And, Jake, wow. right before you guessed that, I was just thinking, you got a little bit of an Adam Gase vibe going on right now. Take it thing. back before I knock you out. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Jake is in the AFC East, and I will also stay in the AFC East. I'm going to go with Josh Allen. Josh Allen is our number four mm. answer at 4,306 <laughs> Yards, well done. Panic. Ow. We can clear a board. Wow. You have a chance to clear a board. Clean, and clear. Don't forget. Bonus point. Bonus point is also available if you get this question correct. I'm going to go with CJ Stroud. That is incorrect, although he did have an amazing rookie guess. year. The other guy. I thought he was going to be the bonus point. Matthew Stafford? That is incorrect. <laughs> No Geno, he missed games, so nobody in the West, and we already have Purdy. Nobody else in the East. I don't think it's Jalen Hurts. Maybe. No commanders established. NFC South, no way. NFC North, Cousins maybe would have been on here, but no. No Jordan Love. That's, uh, oh. it's not Jordan Love. It, Jalen Hurts. Incorrect. Yeah. I'm going to go with Lamar. Wow. Oh. That is incorrect. Jordan Love is a bad guess. Who the hell is it? Oh, I, I, it's because I guess Jalen Hurts. Um, I liked the Jared Goff guess. Is that, is that your guess? That's my guess. And that would be correct. He's our yeah. number two answer with 4,575 nice. yards, and it does unlock our bonus question. Yes. Can you name which quarterback had the 15th most <laughs> passing yards this season? Okay, interesting. So you got to be right in the middle, but you have to consider injuries and stuff. Oh, I know this. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I, I don't. One hundred percent. It's correct. If you trusted your gut panic, you have an outstanding lead. Do I? Do I? I. I. Can I answer this, or can only Jake if answer J- this? If Jake gets it wrong, if I'll Jake gets it lo- wrong, I will allow you guys to guess. Okay. okay so and I, I can get it. I am going to go with Geno Smith. That is incorrect, but a good yeah. guess. I think I will allow you one guess. Now I think this is a bad guess. Lamar Jackson. That is correct. Wow. He's the 15th most passing Whoa. yards this past season. That was good. Name the top five, five receivers, receivers in, in fantasy, fantasy football, football this, this year, year. According to ESPN. ESPN.com. I have a question. PPR? Good question. I don't know. I, All right. I, I would assume, assume it's PPR. not. Oh. PPR is points per reception. I don't yes. know what PPR is. If I told you the total number of points, would that help with no. this question? No. Maybe. We'll find out. Okay. Is it like I like the mystery. Show yeah. me CD Lamb. CD Lamb is our number one answer yeah. by a good amount. Ooh. He had a big year. Yeah, he yes. did. So he I think I think this is P- I think this is PPR. Is CD short for something? I'm not sure. CD's nuts. I don't think it's short. <laughs> well, what is CD short for? <laughs> Then I got. <laughs> I wasn't familiar with your game. <laughs> Didn't know you had that one in the chain. Straight face killer. I'm, oh. I'm going Tyree Kill. Tyree Kill's our number two okay. answer. Let's go. Bing, we bing, know bing. ball. Yeah. Well, at least we know ball. I would like um. I would like um. AJ Brown, please. He is our number five answer. Oh. AJ Brown. <laughs> a little. That's a good guess. Panic. Brandon Ayuk. Brandon no. Ayuk? It's incorrect. It's wrong. That Was that your guess? That's my guess. Incorrect. It's okay. I got excited, and I like him. I would like to go again. I also really like him. <sighs> I feel like this guy has to have good years. Stefan Diggs? Stefan Diggs is not on wow. the board. Boo. I would like to go with Puka Nakua. I thought about Puka that. Puka Nakua is our number four answer. Yeah. Well done, Panic. I feel like this guy had some crazy weeks, but he also had some bad weeks, but he's the name I'm thinking of, and sometimes you just got to go with it. Yes. Show me Amari Cooper. Ooh, Ooh I like to guess, but that's incorrect. Hurt. It's all right. He, had a good, he was big. a little hurt. He had a crazy game. He did have a very he, crazy game. I have a name in my head, so I'll just go with it, because the more you think, the more you stink. Uh, give me the sun god, Amon Ross St. Brown. And that is correct. Bang. He's our number three answer. Well done. A lot of lines love on these boards. Call us Dennis Rodman because we're clear in the boards. Football fans, this is the last weekend of the year to get your football bets in. We've teamed up with DraftKings Sportsbook, and now is the perfect time for you to take your shot at the crown. Right now, all new customers get $200 in bonus bets instantly when they place their first $5 bets on anything. Doesn't matter what it is. Football game. 
basketball game, whatever you want to be. Wondering what can cause you to use your $200 in bonus bets on? Combine multiple bets together for the big game for a shot at an even bigger payout. So go to DraftKings Sportsbook right now, download the app, and new customers use promo code JM football but bet just any five dollar wager on anything and get two hundred dollars in bonus bets instantly that's promo code jm football only at draft king sportsbook go do it now and have fun now back to the video name the five teams with the most fumbles in oh, 2023 i know the number one answer who's a bad team give me uh, the washington football team that is incorrect. Oh, I thought we were just players. No. That would be way too hard. You think you got the Uno here? Let's see it. The Minnesota Vikings. Our number four on our okay. board. All right. Okay. And for context, they had 26 team fumbles. Oh. Show me the Panthers. Incorrect. I see your logic. <sighs> that's though. where I was going because they're bad. Yeah, that's, right? I, that's good logic. Um, Tennessee Titans. Incorrect. <sighs> Do the, your Broncos you fumble the ball? Shut your bitch mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with Jake's Bronx. I will follow up Jake by saying you shut your bitch mouth. That's incorrect. <laughs> yes. <laughs> go Bronco. <laughs> Not bottom five and yeah. fumble. Number six. I'm gonna go with the Saints. That's you know what? I think that's a good guess. I disagree. That's incorrect. Mm. They feel like they fumble a lot. A Derek Carr. Yeah. yeah. I've got a QB who's been hurt. Okay. Um, I've got a team that plays in tough conditions sometimes. I've got a bad team, which seems like this should be the formula. How about the Chicago Bears? Unfortunately, that is incorrect. Jake, you are oh, eliminated son from this of round. A Von Druk. I think I'm going to go with the Buffalo Bills. Nice. I like that pick. Incorrect. All right. You and Jack both have two strikes. All right. My hint is all four remaining teams are AFC teams. That's the answer, you think? That's well, that's that's my next guess. Jaguars. Our honor board at wow. the number two answer. Wow. With 28 wow. total fumbles. <laughs> nice guess, Jack. I mean, I feel like the New York Jetropolitans are on this. Is that your guess? Yes. And that is our number one answer. The wow. New York Jets led the NFL in fumbles with 32 team fumbles. I thought the number one could be the Steelers. It's Kenny Pickett. Has small hands and would fumble. <laughs> or the Browns. Deshaun stunk, and then they played the rookie DTR a lot, and he's like a fumble guy. But that's all I've got. I like that. I'll go Browns at five. What a helpful answer by Jake. That is our number three wow. answer with 27 team fumbles. Hey, claps for Jake on that Nice one. job. Your Pittsburgh Steeler theory is interesting. Right? Right? Part of me wants to go the Las Vegas Raiders because they had an interesting year. AOC. Um, Josh Jacobs, I'm just saying his name, not knowing if he has a fumbling track record. I'm going to go with the Las Vegas Raiders. Unfortunately, that is incorrect, and that gives Jack a chance to (sighs) tie the game. I trust. Show me the Steelers. Unfortunately, that is incorrect. Mm. Great showing either way. It was a team who didn't live up to expectations. The Los Angeles Chargers had 25 Uh, fumbles as a team. Dang. And then Staley. Yeah, unfortunate. Chargers were kind of terrible this year. Name the top five NFL Twitter accounts in 2023 based on this random complex article I read and Googled. Are these teams? Yes. Teams. So this is... And they are, ranked just their favorite. The favorite. Okay. It's so not, not like most followers gotcha. or anything. I've like got that. number one. I have the number one. I have the number one answer. I have you the number one. I have you guys got the I had that other one. Did you also read this article this morning in the no. bathroom? The Los Angeles Chargers were our yet. number one wow. answer. The LA Chargers. Now, could you explain to us why? Their social media team is just oh, fun. Yeah. And they do like fun yeah. things like schedule release stuff and they like troll other teams, but like in a fun way that's not like mean. So. Good for the Chargers and hey, their social team. I'm gonna go. I know these. What do you got? I know this team goes buck wild mm. on TikTok. Oh. So I'm assuming their Twitter is also crazy. Show me the Bills. They are number three on wow. our board. Hey, good job by both of you. You had actual Shoot. information on those guesses. Golly gee, nice work. Willikers. We do social media stuff. Teams is definitely not Patriots. <laughs> 
Because this team broke the internet with their schedule announcement video. I guess them wrong last round. Show me the Tennessee Titans. That is incorrect. Shut up. <laughs> they they oh, do. That schedule nice. video was very good. That enough. was so viral. The people in Nashville. Jake, I didn't write this article. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that. <laughs> that is true. That's true. <laughs> you really have no clue. I have no clue. <laughs> Show me the New York Jets. They are our number two answer, the Whoa. New York Jets. Why do I know this so much board. more than regular football? Because you're on Twitter. Jeepers, you creepers. You're our big Twitter guy. I'm going to go with the other hard team, mm. the Dolphins. That is incorrect, but Thank I God. like that guess. I'm going to go with a polarizing team, just hoping to get, get some points either way. How about them Cowboys? That is incorrect. Yeah, it always was. <laughs> it always was. I think both of you jumped me this round. First to worst. That is true. That stinks. Yeah. Oh, the Cardinals. Incorrect. Oh, okay. Well, they have a good social media. Jack. Fal- Falcons. Incorrect. Wow, oh, speed around. <laughs> okay. I like that. This team had a great year. I know they did something with a comedian I like, so if they're willing to do that, that mm-hmm. puts them over 20 teams. Show me the Baltimore Ravens. That's in. So correct. Change I'm the sorry. complex article, dude. I have an answer. Panic's got it. Panic, you may go. The Seattle Seahawks. That is incorrect. Although they did do a lot of stuff with that, like magician dude, right? Yeah, uh, they they have a fun social media. We're guessing teams out west. So I think we need to go back east. This team's young, and maybe they yes, kind of went young with I it. I was thinking them. Show me the Texans. Incorrect. Is that them? No. Oh. Panic. Oh. Last shot. This is the answer. I don't feel confident about. There's no way they would write about. The Falcons. I already guessed. That. Already guessed. I already guessed. I do believe I have to give you an incorrect on yeah, that. Yeah, that's all right. I, I don't. I don't even want to guess. It's fine. I don't know what. I, I don't know what you guys. You know, think. What, do another guess, and yeah. if you get it right, we'll decide if it's yeah, if yeah, it's okay. good or not. Okay. Yeah. Um, commanders. That is incorrect. Okay. Okay. Our number four answer. Now I don't know how you're going to feel about this panic, but your own New York Giants wow. are our number four wow. answer. Maybe that's they were incorrect. shouting you out. That's it's a incorrect. part of the Giants community. Nope. It's complex. Maybe okay. they think the Talking Giants count is the complex. Giants count. Maybe. And our number five are the Jacksonville Jaguars. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Duval. Which Ooh. five teams had the most interceptions in 2023? And I ranked them by order listed because there are some ties on here. So – one to five, it's like the number one team has the most, but then two and three has the same amount oh. of interceptions. But I just put them in the order that they were listed in the category. Damn. Okay. Who's going first? Most interceptions. So this would be the quarterback with the most interceptions. No, the defense. defense. This is like a, your team had a good defense. So which five defenses had the most interceptions? These teams intercepted the, the, foot, right. the foosball. Right, 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 right. Got some guesses. Very different guesses. Right. Where are you going? Based off this one player, I'm going to just the Cowboys. That's what I was going to guess. That's where I was going to go, too. That's why I really wanted the number. That is incorrect, but well. they are the answer to my bonus question. <laughs> oh, well, you just gave away the bonus no, question. No, that's not the bonus question. <laughs> oh. The bonus question is how many interceptions as a team did the Cowboys have? It's worth one point. I'm going to go 14. The answer was 16 total team okay. interceptions. So that is incorrect, and our bonus question is off the board. Oh, Wait, off. so it's not a lot because it's not on the board. You know what? This team. Can I tell you about this team? Tell me about this team. This team shouldn't have been involved, but they were tough, and they were gritty, and they had a good defense, and they turned the ball over. My Denver Broncos are incorrect. Mm. Oh, We haven't gotten a lot of answers right. All right, this is kind of actually no 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 no. Where where Justin? Where where were you? Why were you going to say this team? There was one team that had a really good secondary that just shit the bed in the playoffs. I'm going to go with the Cleveland Browns. The Cleveland Browns are incorrect. Wow, that's tough. They had 18 team interceptions. Wow. I'm trying to envision a team getting an interception. Oh, it's an interception. I'm just, I'll go with the Ravens. The Baltimore Ravens are not. On oh this. wow! Okay. Have, that's no. where I was going. I have no idea. I am going to go with a team, the famous interception team, the Pittsburgh Feelers. Are not on our list. That is your second strike, Jake. 
Panic. Panic. Where are you going, dog? If you get the number one answer, you really, you basically ice the game away. Show me your place. Good run defense. <laughs> Excuse me? Good run defense. <laughs> I, I have a feeling that they get turnovers and they force turnovers. They get interceptions. Show me the Atlanta Falcons. Unfortunately, <laughs> they were tied right out top side or top six. They were tied for seventh and eighth. Uh, we have you 19 went, team you, interceptions. You went for the good me. defense. <laughs> Crazy. Are you shitting me? Two Is strikes. Hmm? All of us. Is this the start of a new round? Yes, yeah. I do have a hint available. Hint. Okay, hint. In my head, there's only one team in this top five who I think was a good good team this year. I have a guess. I'm not up. What's a team that like was bad, but their defense kept them in a lot of games? I would say that is most of our top five. No way it's the Patriots. Oh. But they're a team with a good defense. Ooh, they did. I don't know. I've been thinking Patriots since the very first thing. So you should guess Patriots. I'm just going to guess Patriots. Unfortunately, that is incorrect. Mm. Jack. Mm. I'm, I'm punted this round. You are locked in on 20 free points in second place. Jake, you still have a chance to I pull ahead. It. You could, If you get the number one answer, you would take the lead by one point and put all the pressure on Panic in a do-or-die situation. Uh, I am going to take famous turnover defense. My favorite city, R.I.P. Mitch, Cincinnati Bengals. Are our number one answer, the Cincinnati Bengals, with 31 team interceptions. They are our number one answer by a lot. Six more interceptions than our second place team. I mean, what we, a clutch call. Yeah. Their defense is what kept them in the games after Burrow got hurt. Now, panic. Jake is only up by one. So all you need to do is get a correct answer, and you force overtime. I want to think the New York Jets. Bad team. Yeah. Defense kept them in it. Mm. But also the Kansas City Chiefs oh. are another team that I'm also thinking of as well. But the New York Jets fit Zoe's criteria of bad team with good defense that tried to keep them in games, but do they force turnovers? I'd rather fail guessing the New York Jets than the Kansas City Chiefs. Now, Mr. Justin Panic, they are our number six hey. answer, which I will allow for one point because they were tied with our number five and number four answer with 22 team interceptions. Tie game, Panic from downtown. Do we keep going? Guys, yeah. Well, here's the, I'll put this in right. your guys' option. I have a bonus question. Available, just a little less hard-hitting football, a little bit more of a goof. <laughs> or would you like to keep going at this one? Oh, I need a different energy. I need different energy right now. I will yeah, leave it up to I, you. I kind of, I'm yeah. over this. But I do want to know, are the, are the, were the Chiefs there? If you guessed the Chiefs, you'd be going home a sad man. So great wow. pivot by you. Great job. Our the, board was the, the number Giants? two answer was the Arizona Cardinals. Sure. The Jonathan number Gale. three answer was the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Okay. The number four answer was the San Francisco 49ers. <laughs> And then Eagles and Jets. I almost kissed the Eagles. Am I? Or is I Jack guess, back or? in? I think Jack might be back Am in. I in. Spoof ball. That's up to you guys. Jackson. I'm Jackson. in. All I've right. Been in. Name the five NFL players who were featured in the most commercials in 2023. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Don't I'd Chelsea. be remiss if I didn't go Travis Kelsey. Smart move. He's our number one answer, Jake. Yeah, okay. We have a, a banger easy. of a first so, answer. So you have to get like two, three, four. I have to. I you have to need do good. to hit two here. Yeah, I have to do good. Mama. Dak Prescott. <laughs> Incorrect. That's a tough answer. That's a tough no get yeah. for me. You just Dak Prescott? Yeah, when there's definitely another quarterback that's on the same team as Travis I, Kelsey that's on this board. I see this guy a lot. Um, I also see another guy. I'm going to go him. I'm going to go Devonta Adams. Devonta Adams. That's a, uh, Jack, that's a really bad guess, my friend. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Just because you see the one Taco Bell commercial? <laughs> it's in his house. It's in his house. It's a sick commercial. Yeah, it's nice. But I it's mean, a horrible guess. Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess we'll just end the video. Are we idiot? Patrick Mahomes. Would be our number two answer, Patrick Mahomes is in the second most commercials. Mahomes and Mahato. I can't believe we allowed that to happen. 
You just deck, and I just <laughs> a Raiders <laughs> minus Devante. team. Or, I can't believe I can't, you're not allowed. I can't believe you didn't crazy. guess Mahomes. Now, would you got? I think the video's over. <laughs> <laughs> so I will just list the next three. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Unless you guys fight, open forum. Open for forum. Yeah, yeah. Jason first. Kelsey. He is our number four answer. Jesus Christmas. Can I throw out Interesting again? hint. Please, it's open forum. CMC. He is our number three answer. Oh, Christian McCaffrey is nice. our number three answer. I was between him and Devontae Adams. All right, you, you two, whoever gets the next one, gets second place. Okay. And it's just open forum. <laughs> Jalen Hurts. <laughs> Oh, that is correct, Jalen hey. Hurts. Jake, what a performance. Woo. Good job. Jake Let's went go from first to last to first yeah. and wins football feud. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe.